Hi, I'm Radu Popescu. Today I'm going to talk about how to extract an MSI from XE setup and use an archive file extractor. This method is pretty straightforward. With the help of an extractor, let's say it's 7-zip, right-click on the setup XE. Next, extract the content in a desired location. Inside the folder, you should see the MSI. Check temp folder location. This method requires you to open the setup exe file. It is important not to proceed further in the installation wizard. In most cases, the setup will automatically start to extract the installation file to a temporary location. For small sized applications, this process happens fast and most of the time you don't notice it. Next, you want to open a file explorer and check the below locations. Sort the content by date to easily detect the extracted MSI. Temp, which relates to C users, your username, app data, local temp, C program data applications catch and C program data temp. In our case, the MSI is located in program data applications cache. Use setup proprietary extract switches. Some setup files open extra switches. This is directly dependent on the software used in the process of creating the installer, but most reputable packaging tools such as Advanced Installer or Install Shield offer this kind of options. First, open the setup exe. Usually in the install wizard, you can see the software used to create the setup. Up next, you can directly go to Packaging Tools support page and find the documented switches there. In case you have a setup made with Advanced Installer, open a CMD, navigate to the setup exe location and type the below command. Replace setup file name with your setup exe name and the temp location with the desired location where you want your setup to be extracted. Extract MSI from a setup made with other packaging tools. Now, if you can't tell what is the packaging tool used to create the setup exe, you can still try to check what parameters the setup support. Sometimes you can get lucky and you might find the extract options there. To do that, open a CMD, navigate to the setup exe location and type the following command. The setup name followed by the question mark or the help. You can see the supported switches in the pop-up. Keep in mind that not all setup exe files have an MSI inside. In those cases, you would need to use a repackager. You can check out how Advanced Install Repackager works by clicking on the link in the video description. For more guides and tutorials, check out the Advanced Installer YouTube channel and Advanced Installer blog.